at nine with bruises around her neck. A woman sharing her story about a man she says tried to kill her. This boyfriend now sitting in Metro jail. Our Michael Warwick reporting live tonight. And Michael, you're finding out this isn't this guy's first time of being accused of something like this. That's right, Lenisa, and it's part of the reason the victim wanted to share her story tonight. The man's name, Lance Lucas, tonight facing at least his second charge of domestic violence strangulation. I'm not the first girl that he's done this to, but I will be the last. I will be the last girl that he does this to. The injuries are clear on the throat of this alleged domestic violence victim, whose identity we are protecting tonight. Sharing her near-death experience, she says at the hands of 29-year-old Lance Lucas during an argument in West Mobile last night. That's when he grabbed me by my shoulders, he threw me down on the floor, started choking me, and I thought I was, I thought I was dead. I thought I was going to die. According to jail records, Lucas charged with domestic violence strangulation for at least the second time. Pleading guilty, court documents show, to a domestic violence charge in 2019 and spending more than a year in jail. I'm blessed to be alive. It was not my time to go. It is my time to be here on this earth and be my son's mother. Lucas's latest alleged victim holding strong for her one-year-old son who was in the home last night. I had to keep fighting for him. Hoping this latest charge will keep Lucas behind bars. Yeah, absolutely. I'll be there to testify every time that they need me to testify because he will go longer than a year. Well, in addition to domestic violence, Lucas is also facing a resisting arrest charge and a felony probation violation. We'd like to share with you a couple of places who support victims of domestic violence, the Penelope House and the Lighthouse. We have the numbers on your screen. If you need help, give them a call. We'll also have those numbers on our website, fox10tv.com. Live in Mobile, Michael Warwick, Fox 10 News.